Soni. I am an NLP Master Practitioner Come Coach and also a Government Certified Trainer. In this video, I will be sharing about the importance of focusing on our solutions. First, we need to understand that problems are part and parcel of our life and it is for everyone. For example, if we go for a job, there will be problem. If we are idle at home, there will be problem. If we are married, there will be problem. If we are single, there will be problem. If we are well educated, there will be problem. If we are illiterate, there will be problem. If there is rain, there will be problem. If there is no rain, there will be problem. If we get into a train, there will be problem. If we miss our train, there will be problem. If we are very kind, there will be problems. If we are unkind, there will be problem. Problems are everywhere and for everyone. If you want to be a successful person, then you need to climb on the steps of failures, disappointments and problems. Without these tools, we will not achieve success. Success is a combination of failures which are put together with solution. Friends, when you face any problem in life, take a step back and think whether the problem is so big that you cannot handle or it is so powerful that you have no control over it or the problem is so big that you feel that it is the end of your world. Friends, when any chapter of your life goes wrong or if any chapter of your life has any failures and disappointments and rejections, it doesn't mean that entire chapters are going to be that way. Friends, do remember that failures, disappointments and problems are needed in life in order to achieve success. Norman Vincent Paul has said that every problem has seeds of solutions. So dear friends, every problem will have multiple solutions. If you face any problem, take your diary and write down what are the possible solutions available and choose which is the best that suits you. Friends, one of the best way to solve your problem is to face it with courage. Sometimes what happens is the problem will be very small but we recall it again and again and we focus on our problems and make it so big that we cannot get rid of it. For example, imagine there is a dot in a paper. Now the dot is very small and it is very thin and now it will be very easy to rub it off. Imagine that you are drawing a dot over and over on it again and again. Now the small dot becomes bigger and bigger and very dark and it becomes difficult to rub it off. The same thing happens with our life. The problem may be very small but we focus on it again and again and we recall it again and again and we make the smaller problem into a very big problem. Friends, instead of focusing on your problems, focus on the solutions. Friends, inside every problem there will be seeds of opportunities to grow. So every problem and failure and difficulty that we come across in life is for our betterment. But we need to find out what are the solutions available to overcome it. This will help you to climb the steps to success. We need to focus on our solutions without allowing ourselves to be controlled by our problems. Now there are two options. Either we can become the master of our problems or we can become the victim of our problems. Now the choice is yours. If you want to be the master of your problems, then focus on your solutions and not on your problems. Friends, at any point of time, if you feel that you are facing multiple problems and difficulties, remember that it is all right and you are working towards success because without failures, you cannot achieve success in life. I hope you like this video. Please do subscribe to get more updates. Thank you.